Hello, I'm Dr. Brian Dury from the International uh, Myeloma Foundation. Welcome to this program, Ask Dr. Dury About Proteasome Inhibitors in Multiple Myeloma. Please note, this program will include a discussion of off-label treatment and investigational agents not approved by the FDA for use in the U.S., as well as data that were presented in abstract form. These data should be considered preliminary until published in a peer-reviewed journal. Today, we're going to address some questions that arise surrounding the use of proteasome inhibitors in the treatment of myeloma. In this segment, I will address the question, what are proteasome inhibitors and what role do they play in the treatment of multiple myeloma? In segment number two, Dr. Shaji Kumar and I will address the question of how proteasome inhibitors are used in the frontline setting. I will then discuss with Dr. Saad Usmani, how does the presence of high-risk disease impact proteasome inhibitor-based therapy selection? Next, Dr. Tom Morton and I will address, how do you select a proteasome inhibitor-based therapy in the relapse setting? I will then discuss what are the adverse, associate, the adverse events associated with proteasome inhibitors, and how do you manage them uh, with Dr. Joe McHale. And then in the final segment, I will provide highlights from these prior segments.